Mis amigos de Fandango Cine, hoy tenemos un cafecito con Nick Frost, el actor de Shaun of the Dead, de At World's End, y Hot Fuzz, muchas otras películas. Bienvenido. Thank you for having me. ¿Cómo estás? I'm very well. How are you? I'm very good. And have you ever had cafecito or this is cortadito before? Uh, no, I haven't. And it's a real treat. Uh, so good. It's, it's very good. Coffee with milk and a lot of sugar. Yeah, I can feel it melting my teeth. <laughs> melting your insides. Yeah. If only it could melt uh, like the extra thing that I have oh, here. Christ, ah. Yeah, I think you're doing a fortune. <laughs> yeah, we should, we should Let's definitely. Let's do it. Yes. Okay. You could be the spokesperson, I can be the mastermind behind it. Done, yeah. Okay, you got yourself a deal. 70-30. Seven, no, <laughs> well, 60-40. Done. <laughs> okay. I'll take 60% all day. No, it was my 60%. Mm -mm. Uh, let's talk about, first of all, your interest in salsa. You wanted to be a dancer, and so one day, oh, let's just do a movie about it. Yeah, I think I thought that it would be a clever way to essentially have therapy about <laughs> a fear of dancing by doing a dancing film. Why were you afraid of dancing, Nick? Like a lot of English men, you know, the, the, our culture is not one where you dance, essentially, you know, men watch women dance and then after drinking it's always better to just watch women dance no it's better to dance with women that's <laughs> well that's where i think the kind of salsa community have it right it, you know you can dance with lots and lots of lovely lovely girls you can you know. grab them well no you can't grab them i think well, that's a a little maybe a little bit sure <laughs> but you know i think it's that what i found really interesting is that The girls told me that if there's a man who's a grabber, mm -hmm. no one wants to dance with him. Really? It's kind of amazing, really. That's why I don't have any love yeah. with that. Yeah. Because <laughs> I was going to say, salsa dancing doesn't do it for me. Maybe because I'm a grabber. You're too grabby. You grabbed me the first really? time. Really? Yeah. Come on. We're not, we're, we're not I thought it was a bit yet. forward. Really? But I let it go. I thought it was just kind of Latin fire. It is the Latin fire. Yeah. I'm sorry if That's I offended right. you. No, I like But it. I'm going to grab you once the interview's sure, over. Sure. One more time. I might okay. let you. <laughs> I also wanted to talk, you wanted to be a rugby player when you were little? I was a rugby player. I played rugby from uh, 14 years, so from 7 to 21. So how did that prepare you to be a salsa <laughs> dancer? Uh, well, I mean, I think I've always kind of been light on my feet uh, and that, you know, I was pretty good at rugby and I think there was, the, there was a lightness of, of foot even then when I played. And, you know, I, I was a kickboxer for three years as well. So, you know, there's learning Learning to fight is a lot like learning to dance in a way, you know, it's all about the footwork and thinking about the next thing you're going to do, not the step you're on, thinking about two steps ahead, you know. So what did your wife say uh, when she saw your moves? Did uh, you use it, them with I her? I think she cried, actually. She didn't... <laughs> Why? Because she didn't like she, them? Or just because... because it was, you know, I think she saw every day what I went through in terms oh. of the training and how much effort I put into it and she... I made sure, and she made sure that she doesn't ever watch anything until the, the premiere. Oh. And so she saw it then for the first time and I think was, she was quite emotional that, you know, <laughs> that's what all that So now was. what will she think when she sees you as a wrestler in your, ne in your next film? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> She's going to cry again. Uh, yeah, but probably not for the, the same reason. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Cheers. Thank you very much.